CNBC says X was hacked, but Elon Musk says that's how legacy media works. Last night, Bitcoin spiked and dumped after the SEC tweeted that the Bitcoin ETFs and spot ETFs were approved, and then Gary Gensler said they were hacked, which was the funniest statement and probably the best escape route. Following the hacked Bitcoin ETF approval post, security lawyers are saying the SEC will have to investigate itself for market manipulation, which I think is valid. How they will investigate themselves is beyond me. But even more ironically, almost immediately before the SEC was hacked yesterday, clearinghouses posted DTC information for the confirmation of a cybersecurity program compliance to rule file SARDI C-20198 on January 11, 2024, followed by fix information and a third one. Ironically, the CC deleted a tweet from October 16, 2023, that said, Careful, your online reading the CC provides the best SEC information. Socks is here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to the channel if you're new. We'll cover AMC, GameStop, the market, and Bitcoin. So watch till the end so you don't have to watch another YouTube update. I'll update you on everything, but please hit the like button. It's free and subscribe. Let's get into the video boom. Look at this trade we hit yesterday in the trading challenge WFC. We went in on earnings after just a little bit of technical analysis. After I saw the stock break above the 555 base off of it and have earnings play out, I also tracked the previous earnings to see how the stock did we win in with a close stop loss and this stock ran up 16.27 right to the zone I had drawn out. And we got out of this play if any of you guys dropped 3.57 on day lottery stocks, where will this bottom out? Let's discuss about AMC's IPO touch point in this downward trend line three touch points right here before AMC flew touch point right here before we broke out. And we came back down and base off of it right now. We zoom in same exact trend line touch point here when AMC hit its low. And now this is exactly what we are looking at. It's not perfect, but AMC, we have been looking for 435 for a somewhat bottom on AMC to finish off the yellow part of the cycle. However, AMC may or may not flash down and get a bottom wick hitting around $3 flash down to that because I'm not going to miss that AMC fire sale. But this is just something I'm watching if you watch my videos. And track what I'm tracking, you know what's coming next for AMC. Now, according to Ortec, short interest slightly risen back up 7.98. On the day, I'm not sure if you can hear that in the background, but my cat is in a litter box and she's digging. It's annoying and probably going to smell. 2.8 million AMC borrowable shares $1,000 calls compared to 27,000 puts expiring in the money and 80,000 call contracts expiring out of the money going to mark makers all of that premium. So it's very dangerous to bet calls, especially on the decline playing against the trend for AMC, a heavily manipulated stock. But we are seeing gamma ramping to the downside. So be aware of that short exempts died down to 98,000. Like I said, they will die down the closer to the target they want to get. And we play through another cycle. AMC would eventually come down to nothing and get delisted. And we would only have until late May or early June before we'd have to do another reverse split. GameStop is blue, spy is orange. And we've gone negative beta off the bell both days this week. Does this mean the algorithms are changing? To rally as well as crypto, you could see this breakout come up to around $21. 20 cents and then come back and base on the trend line at $16 before scaling higher and getting a squeeze, or this could be the spot where another cycle plays out for a GameStop. We hug the top of this trend line until about early February, right February 10th, and then come back down and test the bottom of it again, right around $10 and dip slightly below before reevaluating. High premium for market makers and next week options chain extremely large for AMC. And GameStop, hopefully, we see some green price action. Next week, short exempts, nothing crazy, 9,000. It's down from 15 and then down from 21. So they are slightly letting it go finally. Before we touch on SPY Tesla crypto, the Swiss National Bank posted an annual loss of $3.54 billion for 2023 today. Central banks around the world are in the red. I'm bringing this up because a lot of banks are about to report earnings this week and it's probably not going very well. I'm on Discord every day where we debate stocks. Whether you're a newbie or an advanced trader, this is the place to be. It's vibes, we want financial freedom and top crypto and stocks. We post profits and losses, and I post my positions as soon as I take them. I haven't posted positions in a while because I've been looking at the trading challenge and I'm still in my Tesla calls. Overall, this is in the top of the description and pin in the top of comments. If you're not in there, get in here now for 2024. 
There's no reason not to join also real quick. If you want up to 15 free stocks, each read up to two grand per stock, 5.1 AP on your uninvested cash, a platform that keeps your money. Insured gives you free level two order book data. Unlike Webull, access to trading going short as a retail trader is huge and a customizable earning schedule is excellent. Use my link. Sign up for Moomoo and make a deposit of even a dollar to start earning benefits. The more you deposit, the more stocks you get. It's free money and takes two minutes out of your day if you've done it already, have a family member do it, or a dollar moving on the IPP 547,466 green on the day upon 16 on the day volume is diminishing on this ascent, which means we won't see a straight up push to 47,750, our resistance level and a breakout up to 400. This shows me that we may come back down and base one more time off of 47,000. 275 and then build volume to the upside at least. So just be aware of that and watch that for the SPY. There could be a less aggressive trend line drawn out that could easily show you where it's going to come down to. But right now I want to see volume pick up on this move higher Tesla down again. 923,288. I'll post my positions right here to show you guys that I'm bleeding with you. And overall I'm in this long term. I'm not worried about it except for the contract that expires sooner in February. But if it's trading in this channel we talked about, I'm not worried. If it breaks below this channel, I get somewhat worried on my Tesla position. The following Bitcoin ETFs are listed on SIBO seeking SEC approval. Fence Fidelity Franklin ARK Invest and Invesco Galaxy. Notice that BlackRock is not on here, and SIBO filed a request for acceleration to list four spot Bitcoin ETFs tomorrow. Bitcoin 45,000 broke all the way up here to almost 48 right 478 which is exactly on this trend line we drew up here. Forgot where we got that trend line. It hit that resistance level, perfectly time sec, flushed it back down. We didn't get a full candle close above 46. And that's what I wanted to see because I don't want to see a wick or body breaking through. I want to see a full close above 46 to be bullish on Bitcoin. I'm still holding and adding to Bitcoin. Amazon's Twitch service announced 500 layoffs or 35 of staff and TMC's revenue fell 8.4 year over year in December. Taiwan Semiconductor makes all the chips for NVIDIA, Apple, and others. That's all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit the like button on your way out. As I had hoped, there was no full candle close above 46. This is because I don't want to see a light or body breaking through. To be bullish on Bitcoin, I need to see a full close above $46. I still have Bitcoin and am adding to it. Amazon's Twitch service let go of 500 employees, which is 35 of the staff. In December, Twitch's income fell 8.4 year over year. Chips for Apple, Nvidia, and other companies are all made in Taiwan. That's all for the video today. I hope you liked it. As you leave, click the like button.